Hey guys, welcome back to Gary Gaming TV. Welcome back to Farming Simulator and welcome back to Sandy Bay. Now, I'm on Sandy Bay for this one because it may well be the last time we see Sandy Bay. As um, uh, Oxygen Dave and Bullet Bill and all that have done um, the West Coast, as a lot of you will probably know already. And uh, that is now into Giants. So hopefully within the next week or so that will be released. So as that is also a coastal one, I'm going to replace Sandy Bay with that one because it looks a lot nicer, fuller, more developed map. Um, and with a lot more of the cool stuff on there I like. So uh, I think what I'll do is I shall swap that out. So with that being said... We will do at least one more video on here, as it still is a gorgeous map, and uh, we have work to do. So, uh, this field 14, let's have a butchers at what's going on. It has been harvested, it needs to be uh, cultivated and so on and stuff. So, uh, we'll get him out of the way because my tractor was out of fuel. So, I had to... Um, Getting the old truck down there with some fuel just to fill it up again. I mean, I know it's only 4 degrees temperature wise on the ground, but we should be alright, hopefully, to plant some stuff. Should get away with it. Getting the good old big mass in here. It has been a while since it's been on farming sim. So I may warn you now, I am going to be rusty as hell. Close it up because we don't need filling. Get it all folded. Uh, oops, no, it was lowered. Nope, all the way. And all around. What do we want in crops wise? It's not really a massive field, so. Yeah. What have I already got? Ask the question. What do I already have? Holy moly. Ton of soybeans. That's way too much soybean to be fair. Right, so. That one's growing. I think. 14. I don't really want to go wait. We'll look all it, we'll do that for now. So, I'm gonna do this. <coughs> we'll try and get a um, good go around. Now, hopefully, the slightly choppy freaking videos will be stopping next month uh, due to the fact that. Um, the AMD Vega 64 cards are out. I'm looking at getting the uh, Asus Strix one. So, uh, fingers crossed, it will not cock up or anything like that. Um, and I will have 8 gigs to play with instead of just the 4. So, I will be able to run all the games on full whack and record. No bother, because at the minute, as soon as this hits 90 odd percent GPU usage. On this game, that's when it starts juddering on the video. Um, in a minute, it's running like 87 and see if it's running okay, but uh, as soon as I try and get a lot of stuff in the background, you're all 98, 90 odd, it just tanks. So, whether it's something to do with XSplit as well, I don't know, but we'll get a beefy graphics card and try it. I've never had any trouble before, but obviously. With the more modern games coming out that require more GPU usage, there's not really a lot left to do any sort of video work. Even though XSplit is set to processor, um, 
that obviously shows that it doesn't just use your processor so <coughs> fingers crossed whenever the new one comes out I can uh, get all in one and uh, up the game because there's three or four games that I actually want to do let's plays on the videos on and I can't do it because I just can't record it simple as I think so Uh, I think we'll do one more round. It's a slight overlap. So I don't miss anything, because I'm terrible at missing stuff. So yeah, I've enjoyed this map, but looking at uh, the West Coast one, it just looks really, really beautiful. The roads look really well done. The uh, environment and the textures and that just look gorgeous, the buildings look really nice, so uh, I think I'll give it a whirl, I'll get on it, have a look around it, probably do a review video first, and then I'll have a look and see um, how it plays, you know, I've set myself up and I'll give it a whirl, if people don't like it or I don't like it, I will revert back to uh, Sandy Bay, because I do like this map, it is cool, but there's only so many hours in the day, only so many maps you can play on. And you know I've got Coldbrew and Thornton still on the go, so... In the last video was Coldbrew. the neatest way of doing this now, but... Technically I suppose just square that off. When I fix any bits of hard work, it doesn't get too late. Let's see what the rest of the farm is getting up to. So, uh, yeah, keep an eye on some more videos of other stuff. Um, the wee nipper is doing well, so trying to get any time I can to do these videos in a minute. I'll send him off down then, we'll see how he does. See now he'll go in a straight line, he won't follow the thing, so it might square it up a wee bit. What else have we got? He's sat there. Bailing equipment is in there because that does not class as cover, so I cannot put any bales or anything in there unless they're wrapped. Um, because it won't stop them from getting wet, unfortunately. I think all my tractors are parked up there by the look of it. Um, if I remember, I think. Where did I put the bales that I do have? Ah, oh, they're in here. So the bills I do have at the minute are going in this shed. Um, so that's probably what it's going to be like on the West Coast. I haven't seen the farm on the West Coast yet, but on the review vid I shall go through it and probably lay out what I'm putting where. Only four tractors sat there ready to be done and used. Obviously the awesome Defender. Uh, does that start bouncing through the wall now? I, mean, I can use that shed still for. Well, if I was going to carry on, I'd use it for. Um, what's this? Yeah, so all of my vehicles are sat there. Do a note. Um. They all like fertilizer away. I don't still need plowing yet. Oh. 19's plowed and not fertilized. I don't think I've used 19 for anything yet. To be fair. And obviously, 7 is for grass cutting and all that sort of stuff. Um.
Keys isn't going to quite a good job at that. Oh, that's good, he's covering all for us. Right, he doesn't need to be there, we'll get him back to the farm. And uh, we shall make up a plan from there, I think. What do you reckon? Still enjoying farming, Tim. Um, obviously, I haven't been on for a wee while there, so I was having a look at what mods were out and. It used to dry up a wee bit, there's nothing amazing or major it appeared that I'm like, oh yes, I have to download. There's one or two things that threw me interest, but oh, nothing that was like, oh, that is cool as hell. I'll put the beacons on while I'm driving down these uh, roads. I really wish more of the trucks had these beacons on them. I really wish some of the tractors had the LED beacons as well. Far better than the spin, isn't it? Uh, seem clear. Well, the grass went nice. That's going to start uh, vanishing now that I've got seasons modding. So that is also going to have to be stored somewhere else. I'm trying to remember where the fuel tank was in this place. Trying to think where's better store field truck, not necessarily in front of uh, Bells of Hay, which is where I was going to put it. Oh, oh, I'm sticking in there out of the way of the sun. Away from arsonists, hopefully. So let's think. What can I do next? I need some water tank, and I don't have any animals yet, do I? It's been so long since I've been on this map. I haven't a clue what I've got. Oh, what's going on? Da, 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 da. No, but I've water and grass in for the sheep ready. It's not any sheep yet. Oh, I've plenty of money for it, so I might go get some. Let us get in. Uh, yeah, let's get in the big new island. I think I have... I thought I had a cow truck sat around here somewhere. Maybe not. Check over the other side. Are they rolled? If not, I'm gonna have to get one. Got some of bailing equipment. Ah, my grass cutting equipment. And a truck down there ready to uh, spray by looking.
She hasn't swapped him. I've been going through all these vehicles, which is weird. Oh, there we go. Ah, come on, my old Fords. Okay, so. Uh, looks like I don't have one. I uh, thought I did. Which is strange. Huh, well, would you look at that? I don't. Right. Um, animals, animals, animals. I do like this trailer, I've got to say, it is pretty cool. And being in, uh, that's a new one. Being in Northern Ireland, I do see quite a lot of them about. I don't know why there's two in, unless that's just a rusty version of it. I must have been stuck in an update. So how many does that hold? I love a wee single one that you can um, stick on the back of your car. There's the shop. Where is Stores. I think that's where you get your animals from at the moment. So, yeah, we nip down to the shop, pick up the trailer. And then carry on down to uh, get some sheep. I'm not going to go nuts with a sheep like I'll just buy it for you. Oh, not buy a ton of them. See what I can get. I know I'm steering with a keyboard. I just haven't set up the uh, Xbox controller. It was too sensitive when I first tried it. And I couldn't bother messing with it. Plus, it's not even powered up. So. Church is going off, that's nice. Oh, it's not a very action packed episode, guys, but you know, farming's farming, you gotta get shit done. Sammy Snake, uh, Sammy Snake, so I'm not gonna This is the only trouble I find with this shop that part of things in the stupidest bloody direction. Tell you what you guys would probably like, we had a, um, a work, there was a uh, tractor run on for uh, a cancer charity, and I'm not joking, there must have been over a hundred easy tractors, uh, easily over a hundred, and uh, everything from your old Fords, you had your new Hollands there, you had uh, a couple of fence, Dutch furs, uh, really, oh, fuck, a really nice red uh, vent was the really nice red polished up to the nines it was and um, yeah some beautiful tractors there but easily over a hundred I didn't stay for the whole event I, had, uh, I was finishing work so it only the last wee bit but they were awesome looking all lined up and I said uh, quite a few of you guys that watched this would have enjoyed that
What happens is when you get animals from otherwise? I'm going to boo it. Yeah, there's not there. Uh, it's a tight time. And here is it. Oh. Trying to figure out where you get them from. I'm assuming technically, would you have to put it on that ramp? We'll try it for a laugh and see if it'll work. Rink. Uh, no, it's not working, is it? I cannot buy the sheep like that. Oops. <laughs> Wasn't watching what I was doing there. Oh, well, there might be answer. Come on, we've got to be accurate, haven't we? I was pressing the wrong button. So we might be able to. I thought there was a little marker at the bottom that told you when you're in the right place. There we go. Look. <laughs> Sheep. I'm gonna buy, 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 buy. fourteen at seventy grand. Yeah, we'll fill it up. I'll lose for now. Good sheepies. Happy days. <coughs> Come on, traffic, jeez. The will all start coming down, won't they? Typical. Now there's one coming this way. Can I get out before this one gets here? Go, 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 go. There we go. <coughs> See, traffic is good on these, but whenever the modders up the speed of the traffic, and they don't increase the uh, stopping distance and stuff, then it just ruins it. There's a few maps that have done that, and I've just turned the traffic off to be fair. Too much hassle. Let's go and drop the sheep off in the fields. Uh, hopefully, I uh, will be getting Planet Nomads up as soon as this graphics card turns up as well. There's Planet Nomads, it's dark and light. There is. Was there was a couple of others as well, I can't remember off the top of my head. They just didn't run right. There's even a couple of review videos I couldn't do because it wasn't running right. Um, Ghost Recon Wildlands was one, which was really gutted. Those mirrors, I think, have got better. Whoops. I'm not lucky where I'm going. Uh, which one is it? Uh, this one. Anyway. I can never remember which bloody turn it is for this one. Uh, I'm going to remember when I left up here to the sheep, in it? I think. If one recalls correctly.
Yep, there we go. Sheep is on the map. I'll probably leave this trail on the up to show as well. Oh. This rough ass road. There we go. And I'll have to get open. Can't be doing that no more. Where do we dump them off at? See, I don't get why there's two drop-off points here. There we go. That is a big ass field they've got to play in there. They've got the wall and they've got the grass. They are happy as Larry. And now I have to keep the gate closed. Don't want them going anywhere. Some of these drives are BIH to get out. Like, ridiculous. Yeah, I think to be fair, this one's not something that will be used on a regular basis. Sticking in there. Happy days. Right. I think, to be fair, that is going to call it for this one. I was going to a quick one, guys, but unfortunately I have shit to do. So, thank you for watching. Any comments, questions, please check them down below. Any uh, requests, please check them down below as well. Please like, chuck up that thumbs up, it helps me a lot. And if you haven't already, guys, please subscribe, spread the word. And uh, hopefully you will be back to watch some more of whatever video I am doing at the time. Thanks, guys. See you later.